Is anybody... <gasps> Prune and onion sandwiches! Pickles! Lemonade! <laughs> Come to Pachi. Hold it right uh, there, partner. Uh, you know, here at the RB Ranch, we don't take too kindly to lunch rustlers. I wasn't going to wrestle it. I was going to eat it. Sorry, Fudgy, but I've got to practice. I don't want to look like a tenderfoot when I go to visit my Uncle Grizzly in the Wild West. Hmm. The Wild West doesn't look so wild to me. In fact, it looks a little colorless. Could you untie me now, please? Oh, my Uncle Grizzly says it's plenty wild, especially when you're prospecting for gold. But you've been talking about that trip for weeks, Rupert, and your Uncle Grizzly still hasn't sent for you. Package for you, Rupert. Thanks. I knew it. It's from Uncle Grizzly. How timely. What's all the excitement about, boys? Uncle Grizzly says he wants me to visit him right away. He needs my help. He's closer than ever to finding the mother load. Who's mother-in-law? Mother load, Podgy. When you find the mother load, you've struck it rich. Poor old Grizzly. How many times over the years has he thought he struck gold? <sighs> He's always been a dreamer. I suppose that's where you get it from, Rupert. Does this look like a dream? <gasps> oh, my! Would you mind very much untying me? Couldn't someone untie me? Anyone? First time in the Wild West, son? Yes, and it looks just as wild as I'd imagined. Oh, it's wild, all right. A little too wild for my liking sometimes. <laughs> all this wildness takes its toll on the nerves, if you know what I mean. The name's Shot. Buck Shot. Bear. Rupert Bear. Pleased to make your acquaintance, Rupert. Will you be staying with Kinfolk while you're here? Yes, I'll be staying with my Uncle Grizzly. <laughs> did you say Grizzly? Did, did he, he say Grizzly? Yes, I did, but... He did! <laughs> <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> What's going on? Why are we stopped? Could only be but one thing. We's about to be robbed. I just hope that this time it's the James Gang or the Dalton Gang. Any gang but the... <gasps> the French gang! Bon dieu, Tully Monde. New sums Francie. Howdy, y'all. We're French, and we're a-fixin' to rob you silly. Don's le sac, silver plate. <laughs> y'all better do what he says. Shouldn't we stop them? Shouldn't we... do... something? I am doing something. I'm hiding. And you ought to hide, too. Delbert and Dewey McSwine can be a mighty rough pair. Delbert and Dewey McSwine? Duty sweet. Beat, beat, beat now. They just pretend to be French, because they think we won't recognize them that way. It's just to play along, Rupert. Well, you looky here. Don't you got a little something to contribute? No, I don't have anything. Well, ain't that pretty? It looks just like gold. You can't take that. My Uncle Grizzly gave it to me. Grizzly? Grizzly? <laughs> <laughs> if Grizzly gave you this, it's bound to be fool's gold. But I think I'll hang on to it anyway for sentimental reasons. <laughs> There's the boat shoot, Dooley Mound. They'll approach in for Thanks, y'all. We, we should have stopped them. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, Rupert, but in the Wild West, cowardice is sometimes the better part of valor, especially where the McSwines are concerned. Best just to forget about it. But shouldn't we at least report this to the police? I mean, to the to the sheriff? No need! I am the sheriff! <laughs> Rupert! Uncle Grizzly! Good 
to see you, boy. <laughs> How was your trip? It was fine. Until the robbery. Uh, I should have warned you about that. They'll soon be printing the robbery times right alongside the train schedule. But, Uncle Grizzly, they took the gold nugget you sent me. Yeah, those mangy good-for-nothing prairie dogs. <laughs> well, never mind, Rupert. <laughs> There's more gold where that came from. Law and order just ain't what it used to be in this town. Not since Big Mom McSwine started running things anyways. Big Mom McSwine? Yep. Big Ma started out in the lumber business. But she made her fortune by lying, cheating, and stealing. Now she owns just about everything worth owning in this town. Hotel McSwine, the McSwine General Store, the McSwine Burger Restaurant, McSwine Barbershop, Big Ma's big clothes for big ladies. I see what you mean. Come on, son. We'd best get in the saddle. We got a long ride ahead of us. Where are the horses? This is old Maybell right here. Hey, Grizzly, have you struck the mother load yet? <laughs> You're looking richer by the day, Grizzly. <laughs> Why are they laughing at us? They're laughing at me, Rupert. They all think I'm just a crazy old fool because I've been searching for gold in the same spot for the last 30 years. But I'm going to prove them all wrong. I'm going to prove that old Grizzly's no fool. I'm going to prove there is gold in Fool's Canyon. Fool's Canyon? Down below is Fool's Canyon, over yonder is Coffee Creek, and up above is Coffee Pot Falls. Beautiful! The only thing that ain't beautiful is that with the exception of Fool's Canyon, everything as far as you can see is owned by Big Ma McSwine. That's the McSwine spread yonder, the McSwine de Rosa. Hey, Grizzly, is that you? What are you doing carrying them two fellers on your back? And that's Delbert and Dewey. <laughs> I don't like to be critical, but them two boys is lowering a pair of cockroaches' ankle socks. Why do they call it Fool's Canyon, Uncle Grizzly? Well, because the creek here's filled with fool's gold, Rupert. Fool's gold? Iron pyrite. Looks nice and shiny, but it ain't worth the dirt on your boot. Many an eager prospector's been fooled by it. You'll see plenty of it tomorrow. After all this time, don't you ever feel like giving up? Once you latch on to a dream, Rupert, never let anyone take it away from you. That's what's happened to the folks in town. They had a dream, but before they knew it, the McSwine swiped it right out from under their noses. <sighs> Big Ma McSwine's been after my property for years, but she ain't gonna get it. <laughs> Not from this old bear. <sighs> Never let him take your dream, Rupert. Never. I don't know what you two boys want to go robbing trains for anyhow. We're already filthy rich. Well, we just want to be stinking filthy rich, Ma. <laughs> <laughs> I got news for you. You've had the stinking part down for some time. Oh, Ma, robbing trains is just a hobby. It's like, like coin collecting. And couldn't nobody recognize it was us, Ma? I talked French the whole time. He's good at it, Ma. He really is. I didn't hardly understand a word he said. It's true. I'm almost nearly completely fluid. I don't know why I do it. Working my fingers to the bone, lying and cheating and stealing to get myself in a position where I own every piece of property in the entire region, with the exception of crazy old Grizzly's place. And why in tarnation would I want that worthless piece of rock, you might ask? Simple malicious greed, I reckon. Anyways, the point is... Well, I forgot what the point is. The point is... Looky here, Ma! Y'all did pretty good this time, boys. Thanks, Thanks Ma. Ma! Hey, what's this? Oh, that's just a piece of fool's gold old Grizzly gave to his unsuspecting little nephew. 
I was gonna make a tooth out of it. This ain't fool's gold. This here's a real thing. As pure a gold nugget as I ever laid my tired eyes on. We knew that. Well, it looks as if crazy old Grizzly ain't nearly so crazy as we thought. And his worthless piece of rock ain't nearly so worthless neither. There certainly is a lot of it. I've been sifting this creek for 30 years, and she's still as full of fool's gold as ever. But Uncle Grizzly... Watch out, son! Wow! Wow! How did you know? Tweren't me. Old Maybelle's ears is so sensitive she can hear a falling rock from a good quarter mile away. <laughs> Thanks, Maybelle. Uncle Grizzly, what makes you so sure you'll find real gold here? This. Wow. Is it real gold? Sure is. When did you find it? Nigh on 30 years ago. I just know the mother load's close by. 30 years ago? Will you look at the size of that nugget? Grizzly really has found a mother load. Can I have a look, Ma? Do you want I should roll another rock down at him, Ma? Nah, Delbert, that'll never work. We've tried buying him out. We've tried tricking him and scaring him and plain old hurting him. Can I have a look, Ma? Now it's time we really started using our heads. Well, I'd best get the dynamite, then. Never mind that. You know how I feel about you boys playing with dynamite. Well, this ain't playing, Ma. This is serious business. When me and Dewey blow Fool's Canyon to a million bits, well, we won't even hardly enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna go about this transaction in an intelligent, civilized manner. We're gonna offer Grizzly a trade. He'll give us Fool's Canyon, and we'll give him something he values more than all the gold in the world. Can I have a look, Ma? Well, let's see, we break for lunch, Rupert. I see. Yahoo! Whoops! <laughs> Come on in, Uncle Grizzly. No, thanks. Once that water creeps up over my kneecaps, it starts resembling a bath a little too much for my liking. I'll get lunch started. Keep stale, would you? It's downright impolite squirming around like that when you know full well it makes it difficult for a beller to tie you up proper. You're never gonna play with this. Is that French she's talking, Dewey? <laughs> Delbert! Dewey! He's coming! Get out here! Where's my nephew? How'd you take your tea, Grizzly? One lump or two? Never mind the lumps. Never mind the pleasantries. Where's my nephew? What are you done with him? How about a biscuit, then? Here's the deed to Fool's Canyon. Now, where's Rupert? I'm afraid he's tied up right now. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? Hey! Hey! Oof. Come on, Uncle Grizzly. Rupert! Hey, you can't take that. It's stolen property. Get them! Whoa! Ugh. Why do I get the feeling that you two boys won't be a comfort to me in my old age? Hurry! Quick! In here! Where'd them barbers go?
I'm looking down from a... Well, sorry, Rupert. What do you mean? Well, I've ruined your holiday. I've put you in terrible danger, and all because of my misguided dream of finding gold in Fool's Canyon. I'm nothing but a crazy old fool. I should have let the McSwines have the canyon long ago. But you've hung on to your dream for 30 years, Uncle Grizzly. You can't just quit now. <laughs> you know, Rupert, you might be a little too much like your old uncle for your own good. An underground river! That's right. This ain't just the backup from the falls. This here is the real source of Coffee Creek. Then that means... This way. You were right, Rupert. You can't give up on your dreams. <gasps> the mother load. <laughs> We'd best not celebrate too much till we find out where we are. I've kind of lost my bearings. There. Where are we, Rupert? We're in. Trouble. Ain't that the funniest looking gopher you ever seen? Yeah! <laughs> hey! <laughs> I must say, Grizzly, you're a mighty hardy bear. Huh? You done found the mother load. And on my property, looks like we're rich, boys. Built this stinking rich. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get the dynamite, Delbert. Yes, ma'am. Our business transactions with the bears is gonna be finally finalized, so to speak. I wouldn't be too sure of that. What are you talking about, boy? Only a jackass would try to save you now. Huh? Yeah! Hey! That ain't fighting fire! Delbert, they're getting away. We gotta do something. But what can we do? I don't know. Why don't we do what we did last time? Good idea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Uh-oh.
looks as if you were right all along, Uncle Grizzly. There is gold in Fool's Canyon. Yep. It just took its sweet time getting there, is all. <laughs> <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.